This game is rated M and is intended for mature audiences. Don't let your kids watch it! Hey there, Artie! New tips unlocked. Scrap note 1, 2, 3, and the festival's around the corner. And we get a little elbow grease for help in setting up the festival. Okay, we got a lot of tips to go through, but probably the scrapbook ones will be really quick. Oyashirosama's Curse. In the ancient on Onigafuchi village, the anger of Oyashirosama, his curse, was feared above all. However, it is seldom stated anywhere what eventually happens, and what sort of a divine judgment curse befalls on them when Oyashirosama is angry. From various reports, all hell will break loose. Demons will come flooding out. The miasma from hell will flood outward and kill every villager, letting not a single one escape. The ones evoking images of the village being annihilated stand out the most. These terrifying ideas of divine punishment are in alignment with many other religious beliefs regarding the apocalypse, hell, and it's easy to imagine that they are just ways of convincing people to obey the teachings in order to prevent such an end. Not true, but I get what you're saying. The conditions for inciting Oyashirosama's wrath are likely the same as the taboos in Onigafuchi Village. I believe that when an act was performed that violates one of these taboos, Oyashirosama was teamed, termed angry. And in order to quell his anger, they would perform the aforementioned sacrificial ritual. Okay, yeah, I knew that one was going to be short. It's probably just brief notes that, like, Uichi or something. Uichi? Uichi. Has noted about it. From the scrapbook, too. The Human Sacrifice Ritual. The sacrificial ritual was a simple drowning, involving plunging sacrifices into the Onigafuchi Swamp, which was considered hallowed. Of the rituals of Onigafuchi Village, the one th this one was unique in that the sacrifice would sink slowly over the long course of three days and three nights. I believe that it wasn't so much the killing of this sacrifice that was important, but rather the symbolism of them sinking as the submerging of Oyoshiro-sama's anger. For that purpose, they must have had a passion for learning various methods for keeping the sacrifice from sinking too quickly, to force them to sink more slowly. Unfortunately, as far as I can tell from the records, those methods were not recorded. The scrapbook while the BGs a newspaper. Hey, they didn't have a whole lot of assets. My thoughts are that they must have used logs or some similar material to create a raft. Then set up a scaffold on there, hung the sacrifices up with ropes, and then let them sink little by little over time into the swamp. However, if that were the case, it would not be strange if the ritual implements used for such a ceremony were honored as holy and enshrined somewhere. That is a horrible way to go, by the way. Slowly drowning in a swamp. That would be horrible. I would still take it over some other ways of dying, though. Number three. Implements used for the ritual. Ritual tools utilized in ancient religious ceremonies are commonly referred to as implements, or ritual implements. And even now, some of them are enshrined on the property of Furude Shrine and the Free Families. Uh-oh, does Rika's family have something to do with this? However, the identifiable tools are, are all decorative, and none appear to have been used in rituals governing the dark side of Onigafuchi Village. As the Edo era came and closed, and many tra traditional rituals were lost, were they lost as well? Or perhaps buried in the darkness? I don't believe so. Both the implements used on the night of the Feast of the Onikakushi and those used in the sacrificial ceremony must still exist, enshrined away from the eyes of the masses. Without a doubt, they exist here today, at this very moment, in Hinamizawa. Also, I'm nearly certain where they've been enshrined. What was once locked, steadfastly has, for some reason, changed this year to a cheap-looking padlock. He may be able to do something about such a lock. However, it is not far from the assembly hall, nor is it ever far from the presence of people. However, I will not give up. The night when it comes becomes a blind spot to every villager in Hinamizawa is coming soon. Soon it will be... Watanagashi. Ooh! Someone's gonna be checking that out and trying to find evidence. It's gotta be Uisi and his uh, detectives, right? That would be pretty cool. And festivals around the corner. I don't know who that is. It could be talking. I always thought it was Uisi writing about this. Rabble, rabble, rabble. Oi, oi. Kyono uchi kara hebatte te dou sun da yo. Honban wa ashita da zo. Ashita wa saigo no saigo. Bachiri shinya made moe agatte ikun da gara na. Yosse!
気合い入れてきます<笑>よし若さが一番だみんなお疲れさん渡永氏はいよいよ明日だからな It would not surprise me if that was Takano's notebook. Tomorrow was finally with Tanagashi. Festivals are split into two groups those who enjoy them and those that support them. The former only need to prepare their minds, but the latter needs not only that, but also painstakingly crafted plans and preliminary arrangements. While the general majority attending goes about enjoying the festival without a care in the world, will be strained the whole way through. Why? <laughs> <laughs> they have one joke, and it's the funniest. At times like these, it's best to have energetic, physically fit people. It wouldn't be worth it if you didn't do your best until the end, enjoying it the whole way. Uisi-san came in. Everyone hurried to stand up. Hi, hi, everyone. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Not even my seniors, who usually talk big about themselves, can hold a candle to Uisi-san. We all bow as if we were one of those cheering squads of old. <laughs> Karado Uisi. A detective just waiting to retire, one who doesn't pay much mind to rules and regulations, and doesn't do too, too much in the re way of real work. He looks like a rotten old man with a penchant for dirty jokes. My seniors, though, tell me he was a real fighter in his younger days, and that he may or may not have, been, have, have quite a heroic legend trailing behind him. Anyway, he surely had much more dignity and presence in the room than the section chief who came in with him. Everyone present stands upright and lends their ear to the chief's directions. ですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですですです
That's a little weird. Oh, I guess Mion doesn't have the lizard eyes. I thought for sure it would be like, I can't believe you listened to that again. Actually, we'll give it time. Oh, the beer was the best part. What? <laughs> the slight muscle pain throughout my body and my sluggish movements were already obvious. I grin dryly and the three of us break it out into laughter. Are we still going to do the shooting arcade like we did first time? I hope we do something different. We gotta spice it up. Right, I just remembered. Today was Rika's big performance. She had been practicing especially hard for this day. As her friend, I needed to make sure I went and cheered her on. Keiji seems like he'd be, like, if you were friends with him, he'd have your back. At night. That was a cool transition, actually. The transition from sunset to night. Man, how long is this walk? As we got closer to the shrine, we started passing by more people and seeing a lot of parked cars. It began to get noisier, too. I thought I could hear something like a Bond dance song. Without being able to restrain my impatience, I dashed up the entire flight of stone stairs. This is his first time at the Wata well, second time <laughs> at the Watanagashi Festival. <laughs> he wants to have a better time than the first time. Whoa! The shrine grounds! They were packed with people! Look at them all. It was a festival if I ever saw one. This is their Christmas. <laughs> they don't have real Christmas in Japan, so this is the closest they get. Yeah, there were a lot of villagers here that I didn't really know. They must have all been pouring in just for today. <laughs> Why did the music reset when she appeared? <laughs> Satoko too seems somehow energetic. Of course, I'm the same way. She's desperately hunting for that last secret power nut. She's already a proper girl. I see. Rika is the shrine maiden for today's festival, after all. It's probably a pain for her to say hello to all of the elders. <laughs> Did I say that out loud? Or was that a thought? That was our thought. Rika, you are telepathic. <laughs> Calm yourself, Rana. Rika wore an immaculate Shrine Maiden outfit that looked fresh off the shelves. It was a perfect fit for her somehow mystical appearance. Thanks, Grandma! As she spoke, she began to do some twists and stretches. There was approximately one person here getting a nosebleed from watching Rika move. That's not how nosebleeds work! <laughs> yeah, I, I like... I think best Rika is the Rika in the Shrine you made outfit. I like the modesty. Okay, bro, let's not be creepy now. And there's the creepy. 
Rena's eyes and mine glittered with stars as our nose was bled and we drooled. That is not how nosebleeds work! I can't believe I'm a green of Satoko here. <laughs> Why are you saying that with a smile on your face, Rika? <laughs> I love it when people make me the center of attention. We all laugh together again. <laughs> the only daughter, because there are definitely two of them. I'm, I'm game. Oh, I'm less game. いかまで入れるとは今年は奮発してるね。へえ、美味しいね。美味しいね。ああ、イカってのは食ってもうまいが、それ以上に匂いが香ばしいんだよな。I I've watched enough Food Network that I could probably do that. うん。ケイチ君が美味しそうに食べてるとなんだかいつもよりもずっと美味しそうに感じるもんね。俺はうまいものはうまいっていう主義なんだよ。だから俺がうまいっていうものはとりあえず試してみる価値があると思うぞ
しっとりと味わわせてくれる自信作タコが入ってない分だけ素材の味が程よく It wasn't half bad, but after hearing the There's no octopus in it clause, even more people left the line. Rika chan, what do you have to say? Rika's just like, this sucks. So, to play, so. Korede 400 yen wa takai no desu. 400 yen for something that's not even as advertised. Yeah! That was too honest! Even more customers leave the line, dealing the lethal blow. There were other Takayaki stands after all. Yeah. なんかその私らとんでもないことをしてるような。The guy who owns the stand is like, I'm gonna kill you. ほら、サトコあんたが始めたことなんだから、ビシッとここで逆転させなさいよ。うん、無理でございますわ。タコの入っていないたこ焼きなんてどう褒めればいいんですの ?Oh, also, I don't, I just realized, I don't think I ever saw the different art style for the Shrine Maiden costume. <laughs> Rika looks so disappointed there. Oh, that, look, that looks nice. <laughs> you know what? Let's go for this art style for a little bit. <laughs> God, you idiot! Satoko's angry outburst was the finishing blow. Because we just. Dude, if you made bad food, that's on you, not on us. Ugh. There's no saving this crowd. Perhaps I, Keiichi Maibara sama, will lend a generous hand. Keiichi nara, kitto nanto ka dekimasu desu yo. Takonashi takoyaki yasan wo taskete agete hoshii no desu. But it's his own fault! Egao de toge no aru koto wo yuna. Glad I can make you hungry. Ma, wakatta. Ore ga pro no waza wo mise te yaru kara, yoku mite ro yo. I shoved the stick into an octopus-less takayaki and crammed it into my mouth. As before, there wasn't any octopus in it. But Mion's had some in it. That was the important point. Everyone gasped in surprise, including the takayaki vendor glaring at us. The takayaki vendor looked down, unsure. Those watching were listening intently, knowing until wanting to know why octopusless takayaki deserves such a high rating. He loved it so much he ate it ahead of time. <laughs> you are just lying. Well,そうだね。私の食べた一つにはタコは入ってたし、タコが入ってる分にはそんなに悪い味じゃなかったろ。そう。それが本物のタコ焼きだ。それ以外のタコ焼きは。Is that really how you're gonna do this? She's gonna be a politician. That's not a good thing. I don't want politicians that do double speak like this. I want. I think. I want more politicians that are just regular people who are like, eh, I care about the community. I think that I think that would be better. But the problem is most top politicians go into it because they want to be famous slash have power. Which generally don't make for good politicians. Then the man who had been looking down this whole time mumbled. Ah, so yo. Akashi no tako wa sugoku takai in da yo. Demo oyaji san wa Akashi no tako ni kodawatta n da. Yasumono no ii kagen na tako o tsukai ba ikura demo gomakaseru no ni. Oh, is that, is that how it was? Akashi no zanai no ni Akashi to yu nobori o tatete hanbai shiteru inchiki takoyaki ya wa ikura demo aru no ni. 
<笑>おやじさんは小馬鹿さなかった。嘘をつかなかった。全ケイチプリグッドアッツアクチュアリ。このそれは何ですの数さ、たこ焼きってのは一船八個がポピュラーだ。いくら本物の証のタコだからって言
部活の部長たるもの相手がなんでやれ逃げられないね。Everybody, everybody needs a goldfish. ミオンさんのお手並み、拝見でございますわ。The onlookers were also watching m i o n with hopeful eyes. ヘルシーはい、アミットワン。You want a pet goldfish? Okay, m i o n that's a little close. Think about our personal space, all right? Ha <laughs> ha! Here we go! Let's go back to the remake out style. Hmm. Kingo, I'm not eating a e n e h It's n e w i s o No! Back! Kono c h e e s i n o Nanka, Sonoma Boribori to Nama. Mion, you're being weird. Mother, run, 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 去年レナからもらったのも食べちゃったの<笑> ?Well, it's like sushi! <laughs> ち、違う。あ、あたしそんなこと言ってない。Mion's face went red and she shook it vehemently in denial. いや、でも、今、ミオン、お前自分で言ったぞ。<laughs> I was just... 実に美味しそうだ。I was just pandering. <laughs> ええ、確かに。Oh, there she is! お姉って雑食ですから、口に入れば何でも食べちゃうんです。No, Rika. Wait a second. Hey, what the hell? What the hell? Shion, how long have you been here? Hi. Kei-chan, your name is Minna. Konbanwa. She's just been tagging along. Oh, Nate, she was a wanga seeker, a summon in its care of a mister. To be fair, there's nobody she owns age in the area. It's all like old guys, like, I can't wait to eat not real octopus. <laughs> oh, the beer is the best part of the night. <laughs> She asked, grabbing my arm and pushing her chest into it. Okay, she owned that's inappropriate, and we don't do that here. All right? Oh, wait, I can't use that as a thumbnail. That spoils that they're two different people. Uh huh. Excuse me, she forced her bazongas onto me. Again, that's not how nosebleeds work! <laughs> Okay. Not really a fan of Shion no mo. Shion's your cleavage. It's it's right up against my chest. Yeah. It's not our nosebleeds work! Yeah, that's actually kind of a justifiable reaction. Rika, sweetie, how about you go play somewhere else? Nope, nope, this is wrong. This is very wrong. I'm not reading any of this. Uh uh, I'm not reading any of this. Uh uh. Shion, Rika, and I, our faces now bruised, fall to the ground, limbs sprawled. Oh, did Rena just punch us out? Good. <laughs> That was very, very You deserved it, Rika. Yeah, I'm with you. What the what the butts was that, Rika? That is completely inappropriate. Ugh. Now that Shion was here, the energy around us had increased by 120. I don't like the energy she's bringing. Oh, it's so funny. Sexual harassment is a joke. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't like Shion no mo. So, this is interesting because in chapter one, Rena was the 
crazy psycho that I wanted nothing to do with. But now, in Chapter 2, Renna seems like she's the only real winner out of the group. After teasing her older sister so much, Shion ran away into the crowd of people and disappeared. How have we gotten to the point where Satoko is the like, second most likable character now? Rena smiled happily, earning her a whack on the head from Mion. This started out so wholesome. And then you do that to me. We went about just like that, really noisy and lively to the other stands. We were paying money towards the beginning, but midway through, the guys running the shops thought we were just too funny, and we ended up being able to fool around without paying much more. Plump. The vigorous sound of a big taiko drum echoed through the air. Oh yeah, Rika, you need to be going. Right, it's just about time for Rika to appear in her offertory dance. <laughs> it's just like the Arthur theme song said. Believe in yourself. That's the place to start. Mion slapped hard on Rika chan's back. I ball my hand into a fist and raise it into the air. Rika gave the best smile I'd ever seen and then pivoted on her heel and ran off. I got it! Jeez! I rubbed a hand through her hair! She was worried about her go a good friend up to the end. I did not read that right. Oh well. Mion ran off and everyone else followed a moment later. A large amount of people had already clustered into the tight space to watch the edifying dance. 